Today it is a cloudy day, not too bad for lawn mowing. Uh, we've got a few jobs today. Um, thankfully the, they are all lawn mowing, they're days that I like. So uh, welcome back to another week, Days with Wistol. Today we're working with Crystal. Um, fuel is empty. Spewing. Go get some fuel this morning and then head on out to the first job. So yeah, let's get to it. Got the trailer on the back today. Basically because we've, for all the lawns they were pretty much catching. Um, I don't think any are, oh actually one's mulching. But majority are catching and that, for that, uh, the reason for that is because a lot of them have um, some weeds. So, you don't want to drop the seeds into the lawn to regerminate again. So most of them are catching today, so we've got the bin and the trailer on the back, as you can see. But we're going to get out there and get to it. Second job at the moment. Crystal's just uh, mowing just at the back there. Um, have to pull to the next door neighbour's lawn because it's a busy road here. You've probably seen this one before, um, one of our regulars, we mow it quite often. Uh, but yeah, so just mowing the verge and then heading on off. We're going to do some blowing and then head on to the next job. Today's a bit of a quieter day, which is good. So uh, yeah, we're going to get to it and hopefully have an early finish. Just finishing up here. Um, this is the third job. Just a lawn and garden maintenance job. Um, got a couple more. A couple more jobs before um, yeah we finish up for today. Spring's getting the uh, lawns to grow a little bit quicker, but um, still a fair few weeds out at this time of year. And Bindi's starting to really take off. See a lot more of the um, flowers starting to pop up in the lawn, so it's time to spray those. But um, other than that, today's a pretty good day. It's quite warm compared to previous weeks, but um, it's to be expected at this time of year, and it's only going to get hotter until we get into the swing of things in summer, and then it's going to be really hot. But anyways, on to our next job, and see how we go. Second last job of the day, this lady likes it mowed really short and scalped. Um, not sure why, probably to get it mowed less often. We only mow it every now and then whenever she calls us. But um, yeah, unfortunately, they don't understand the one third rule. And I don't like these plastic edges either because you can see they just fall over and fall out. They're not um, sturdy enough like metal garden edges. But anyway, ne anyways, nevertheless, we're going to get blowing and, uh, yeah, finish this one up. Just got home, just uh, had to take a brief break, responding to some messages and uh, booking people in for tomorrow. So, um, anyways, drop Crystal off, got a couple more jobs to do before finishing up for today. Um, and then, yeah, on to tomorrow. So tomorrow we've got a bigger landscaping job, got to uh, flatten out some garden beds and remove a whole ton of weeds and um, also some yuccas and shrubs and all that sort of stuff. So it should be interesting for tomorrow. But um, other than that, we're going to get back out into the field and uh, we'll keep on going. Briefly just taking off the trailer, then heading back out with just the ute because we've got a spraying job and then oh, I've got a lawn mowing job and then a spraying job. So, don't need the trailer because we've already done the main majority of work for today. Currently 2.24. Trailer's off, on our way to the next job. Let's get going. I've just got an email. Phone never stops. But, um... Alrighty, so we're at the lawn mowing job. This one's a little overgrown, but um, nevertheless, gonna get started and uh, get to it and finish. Hopefully, 
before dark. So I think it's three, three something. Yeah, it's three o'clock, so yeah, it should be home before dark. All right, let's get to it. Finished that one. It was a nice quick in-out job. Uh, she said she's gonna call me back in a few weeks time to get it done again, just keep it maintained. So we're on to our last job. Uh, on our way, it'll take a little bit to get there, so. Yeah, this one is uh, spraying pavers as well as spraying spraying uh, their lawn to get rid of some broadleaf weeds and bindi and all that sort of stuff. Because bindi really ramps up uh, as soon as spring hits and it's spring's just hit, so we're seeing little flowers pop up all over the place. So on our way there now and uh, we'll be there soon. Last job of the day, just filling up the sprayer with cutlass. This is the stuff that I use to spray lawns for broadleaf weeds like this. So we're gonna spray the grass back in front to kill all the broadleaf weeds for a client. And also with, um, we've also sprayed all the pavers and everything like that. So now we've just got the lawn left. Backyard, so some broadleaf here, some little winter grass, clover, as you can see here, oh this isn't actually clover but yeah, you can see quite a few different sorts of broadleaf weeds, let's have a look here, see more broadleaf, more broadleaf, This is clover. Well, that didn't pull it out. Here's some more little broadleaf weeds. See, we're just going to be treating all that and getting rid of a lot of it. So, yeah. Alrighty, so if you can see there, we found the culprit of the patchy lawn. So this lawn's got a severe case of lawn beetles, so we're going to have to treat that in the coming uh, future to try and get it re uh, rehabilitated a bit, because as you can see, it's quite all around. So at least the problem has been identified and we can now set up a, a regime to get it back into place. We're just, we're just still spraying for broadleaf weeds. It's quite a bit of it. But yeah. Anyways. I'm going to get back to it. To make mention of this browner section here. As you can see this roof doesn't have gutters. And if you look extra close. You can see that the grass is sort of going a bit browny, purpley sort of colour and that looks to me like rust from the roof because it's tin roof so so there's a few things we need to address for this lawn in the future alrighty so that's the end for today Final, final job of the day. Um, so, definitely things to address with this lawn. Um, with the lawn beetle. But uh, at least we know what the problem is. As you can see out the front as well. As you can see with the front as well, it's quite patchy. 
so we're going to be addressing that in the future and getting it getting it back to being a proper green and healthy lawn so yeah on our way home finally home after a long day at the office it is currently 6 11 so sun's pretty much almost down just started raining on the way home but um that wraps up another day. Hope you enjoyed the video guys and if you did hit the thumbs up and as always subscribe to the channel for more videos. We will catch you next time on the next episode. Cheers.